Hi, welcome to this SkiPad support video where we're going to show you how to edit your property listing after we've set it up for you. So, once you log into your owner's dashboard, there are two ways that you can get to your property listing. The first one is by clicking on the listings tab in the menu bar on the left there, as you can see. And when you click on the listings tab, it will reveal three options and you would click manage listings. There's also here, if you click active listings in the home dashboard tab, that will take you there as well, but we're going to click the link in the left for now. And that will bring up your listings list and as you can see I've got two listings here but the one I want to edit, the bottom one, we click the yellow pencil and once we click the yellow pencil it's got edit above it in red that will load up your property listing and here is where the bulk of the information on your listing is kept and as you can see we've got many different sections here now I must say that if you wish to edit anything in this tab you must click the edit listing button at the bottom or else navigating away from this tab will mean that all your save changes will be lost now here I'm just going to add a swimming pool one minute away because the apartment that I'm doing the listing for has a swimming pool on site. So I'm going to put it one minute and then we're going to click the edit listing button as I said to ensure that any changes that we've made on this tab have been saved. Once the page reloads you'll see the green success box in the top right hand corner that tells you that changes have been made. Now from here we've also got tabs for photos. There's the photo uploader and you can see all the photos that have been uploaded for this listing also got a videos tab because you're able to upload or embed one video for each property listing as you can see I've got an embedded video there the rates tab that will be where you input all of your rental rates there's the field there and there's your rates calendar and down the bottom a summary of your rates with dates and prices availability will be where you state your property is already booked up as you can see there the red in the availability calendar shows that there's already a booking in that week Finally we've got paid services, these are highlighted and featured listings and these are upgrades that you can pay for with SkiPad and we'll be covering them in a future video. But that is how you edit your property once we've set it up for you on skipad.co.uk.